This is a training video for Seattle Public Utilities Recycler Reporting app. This online tool is for Seattle businesses that collect and process material for recycling to submit their annual reports. You can find the tool online at web8.seattle.gov slash CE underscore recycle report client. This new web-based application is an easy way to submit your annual reports online. This video will take you through all the steps from setting up your company if you've never submitted a report before, or submitting reports if you've done so with us every year. If you've never submitted an annual report, you'll need to register your company. From the introductory screen, you'll want to go here and click to register. It'll bring up a different screen here and you'll want to make sure that you fill in all the fields that are marked with a red asterisk. These are all of the required fields. As you move through the information, make sure that you put your main company's contact information in. Your email is very important. Make sure that you use a valid email address. You will receive special codes to be able to log into your account and your reports that you've submitted will go to that address. As you complete your profile, make sure to choose whether you're a collector or a processor and click register to complete. If you've submitted annual reports to us in the past, your company will already be in the system. You can look up your company one of two ways, either by your company's name or by your FAS ID number. Insert the beginning of your company's name and you can search by company name by clicking on the box. This will return a list of various companies that have a name that is similar to what you entered. Choose Select from the side menu. From here, you want to make sure that you check the email that is registered to your business account because you will receive a verification code which will log you into the system. Once you are logged in using the verification code from your business's email, you can begin adding records. From the main screen on the dashboard, here you can add a new record. You will need to create a new record for each of the different materials that your business processes. You can choose from the drop down menu. If you need more assistance in selecting the right material, you can look at the materials definitions list. You can also add an additional material description in the field below. You will also need to add the tonnage of the material that you have processed. If you do not currently collect that information in tons, we have a converting tool that you can use as well. Make sure that you check if your company that received the material is located in Seattle, and you can choose from the list of businesses that are listed in the drop down menu. You'll also need to select the final use of the material, and then you can add any final use descriptions. When you're done, click Submit. You'll see the record below. If you'd like to add another material to your report, please go ahead and follow the same steps of choosing material type material description, and tonnage. Again, make sure that you filled in all of the fields that are marked with a red asterisk as these are required fields for your report. Once you've finished entering all of the materials for your annual report, you'll want to print them. From the main dashboard screen, click Review Report at the top. Here you'll see all of the records that you've entered so far and click Print. This will bring up a standard print screen, and here you can select your printer. Once you've selected print, it'll bring you back to this main screen. This also triggers an email report to be generated to your business's email account. You can also edit and update your company's information in the web app. From the main dashboard, go up to Manage Company Information. Here you will be returned to the screen where it has all of the key information about your business, including your mailing address and your business location and your role. Hit save for any changes. And now you've got one final step, saving your reports and logging out. screen, you'll see save and log out. It's as simple as that. Once you've done that, you'll return to the main screen. Thank you all so much for submitting your annual reports.
If you have any questions about this form or you have problems accessing your account, look at the bottom of the main dashboard screen here and make sure to click the link to contact us. Once again, here is the URL for the web application, web8.seattle.gov slash CE underscore recycle report client. And thank you so much for submitting your annual report.